All the games from the bargain bin. Watch them being played by him or him. It's the bargain bin, brothers. Hello. That's uh, Tristan doing Cubicle Quest today. Uh, it's a three dollar game on Steam on sale right now for thirty cents. Um, it just seems like a standard RPG maker. I did play a little bit before. Um, it's got a good sense of humor. Uh, no. For the controls, it's just Z, X, and the arrow keys, and shift. I am not Bob. Bob's not even my uncle. I have cousins, and Bob's their uncle. I have yet to ever use the expression, Bob's your uncle, to them, though. So, I guess it's just not something that comes up. Old apartment. The next day, the next day, the next day. Well, if you have that attitude, everybody wakes up the next day, the next day, the next day. You probably should try to making enough money to live and washing his laundry. Huge plans, and instead he decides to go sit and stare at the TV. That is self-fulfilling. If he decides, oh, that won't happen, I'll just stare at the TV and stare at the TV. So here's your land, you're in a magical figurative world where your debt are armies that are attacking the castle of sanity and the interest on them is the soldiers in the army reproducing, so I guess they're like orcs or something. And the second army reproduces very fast, so that's your second credit card high interest rate. It, it's, got, it's got a witty sort of... a witty sort of sense of humor. I like it. I'm not an RPG fan, but if you like RPG Maker, then uh, is this one. Do, do, do. You can get a roommate, get a promotion, go to a dungeon of work. So, going to work is a dungeon. Castle of Sanity uh, represents your apartment, clearly. There's a chest over here. You can use a ring of sanity to teleport home. Do, do, do. do you like the music? Would you like the music if it was, what, 15 times louder? No? I did not. I think my ears are still bleeding. This is 7% volume. Yeah, he got cut off by his parents. Right after graduation. So. Dungeon of Arc. So over to the right here, there's a break room. Talk to this guy. When I first saw this guy, I thought he was going to let you like, move in right away. That would be so unrealistically convenient. But, uh, just like real life, he says, yeah, um... Let me know. And that guy's been working here for 40 years and won't retire for another eight. So, that's not good. These people who are in the cubicles, if anyone doesn't know what a cubicle is, those are them with the little tiny workspace. Those ones are made of stone, which is probably the only way to make a cubicle worse. And this is the dungeon of promotion fight through it, and you win, and you get promoted. Did you ever find a sandwich at work and eat it? If you did, you either got sick, or you're a horrible person. I have to kill the office break police. I have not been in a fight, so I don't have a level. I don't have that. To quickly defeat Officer Prince. If I die right here, I'm gonna laugh. Special self esteem! I feel good about myself. I am a great person. There you go, now he feels that's good sanity again. Did I already comment on his face? Look at his eyes. Am I doing his face good? I can't not do one eyebrow. There's just no way to not, there's no way to take it seriously. I was victorious. And I found a re rethink life. Potentially he should rethink his life. Got a new goal. Now a goal is equipment, which I did not know the first time I played this. Goal, get promotion. A community will help, so he's not in isolation. 
maybe a, a virtue. And stop coming around the resume at one point. Okay. If I save, I'll save just in case I screw up. Alright. Okay, first random encounter. Meaningless task. He did it in one hit. Beautiful. Okay, I'm going to utilize my awesome sense of self-esteem again. Alright. This guy wants a promotion, but he spends all day in the break room. So, that guy, the guy that was, I passed. Irritating co-worker. Mm. I feel weird attacking an irritating co-worker. I evaded them, though. That's what you do with irritating co-workers. Good call. That is indeed exactly what you should do with your kid cores. But now, apparently, I'm hitting them in the face, which is not recommended to do to real irritating coworkers due to the police being called, being fired, etc. And you're just a mean person. Irritation does not need to be met with violence. Come on. Drudgery. Drudgery has a sword. Defeated that. Ooh, I should probably utilize my self-esteem again. I attack. I gotta make that face again. I can't not do the eyebrow. Ah. New community work acquaintances. So, equipment. He now has some good special defense. That's very helpful. So, he's less damaged. His sanity is more resilient due to having friends. Well, work acquaintances. So, could be worse, dude. You could be in isolation. You could have no one. Slow computers and drudgery. Let's just straight defeat the drudgery. Ooh, but now he's unmotivated. Oops, I accidentally hit a different target. When he's unmotivated, he has a tendency to miss, as in to fail to accomplish his task because he's unmotivated. Ha! Ha 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 ha! It's witty. It is so witty. I haven't run into the boss, which killed me before. It's good. I think I can. New obligations. Can I defeat the new obligations? Is it weak against paperwork? Mildly. I'm now unmotivated. That's not a good thing. I'm gonna use some... I'm going to eat a sandwich. A sandwich will help me with my new obligations. That's how it works, right? Do some paperwork at it. Let's just see what it does to normal attacks. Oh, paperwork's not really doing anything, is it? No benefit. Ooh! Well, that's unfortunate. I failed. This is supposed to be an easy RPG, and I am failing. I just do not play enough of these. I'm way back here now. Well. I think I'm gonna keep playing this, record a few more. Uh, but I'm also going to cut it off here. Um, if you like RPG Maker, and you find a sense of humor about the, the drudgery of life, then uh, you can pick this game up. I'm not a big fan. Um, it seems kind of odd. It's got some interesting metaphors for everything that he deals with, working class life, but at the same time, um, it's really, uh, 
got got the same things as every RPG Maker game with you know some some investment stuff added to it. So I'm gonna give it 7.5 out of 100. But again, if you like RPGs, it was only 30 cents for me. It's only three dollars normally. So you can check it out.